Mr. OVC, Mohan Bhagwat says, we had special devotion towards some places, we spoke about them, but we shouldn't bring out a new matter daily. Why should we escalate the dispute? We have devotion towards Gyan Bapi and doing something on that front is all right. But why look for a shivling in every masjid? He is effectively saying, let's forget all the other cases, let's perhaps sit across the table and settle the, settle the matter of amicably. Are you ready to sit across the table with Mohan Bhagwat? Or do you teach him as untouchable? What do you want me to do? Sit with him for what? Sit, and with, sit with him for what? Issues. Resolve all contentious there is, issues. There is nothing to be resolved. Everything has been resolved when the parliament had passed the 1991 act. Everything has been resolved when the Supreme Court has, has upheld that act and elevated it to the level of the basic set of the constitution. Simple as that. Let the, that is why I am saying I do not want all these false assurances from Mr. Mohan Bhagwat and, 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 on, and all his company. I want my Prime Minister to say that his government will stand by the 1991 Act. Period. Simple. End of the matter. Can I therefore ask you, if the and Prime Minister, the, if the and, Prime and, Minister and, of the country therefore repeated what Mohan Bhagwat said, would you, would you take that at, at, at face value and seriously? Would you then say that yes, if Prime Minister Modi is saying this, I believe that the RSS, the BJP are acting within the realms of the Constitution? Will you accept that? If the Prime Minister tomorrow addresses the nation in his monkey bath and says that his government will stand by the 1991 Act, you will see within 24 hours all these jokers, these johnnies who are jack in the box, they will keep quiet. But it is convenient for the Prime Minister to keep quiet. It, it, and please remember, the US State Department has issued a report on 3rd of June. Why is the Prime Minister succumbing to the pressure of US? If the Prime Minister had spoken and said 91 Act is supreme, end of the matter. Because the US has now put our great nation in, in, in a country of, of concern. In India has responded to the US saying they have no business to interfere in our internal matters. They should worry about their own politics, the hate crimes, the gun control that takes place there. Yes, of course, of course, I have read the statement. But what did Mr. Mohan Bhagwat say in, in, in his yesterday's speech? He said that in Ukraine, the Western powers are, are, sending, are, are sending weapons. So today the government says, uh, uh, World Bank politics. So what, you know, that is why I say that I want a commitment from the Prime Minister of the country that his government will stand by 1991 Act. And Rajiv, please remember, have not your channel, whether it is Ashtak, whether it is UP Tak, whether it is Headlines Today, whether it is uh, uh, the great Sri Sri Rajdeep Sardesai, what have you shown on the program? I have been shouting, it's a, it's a fountain. But other side said, no. Now Mr. Mohan Bhagwat says, oh, don't do it. If no, no, Mr. No, no, Mohan no, Bhagwat... No, no. Is Mo, Mo, Mohan Bhagwat has not said that it is not a shivling there. He is saying, why should we be going into every mosque, finding out whether there is a shivling there or not? At the same time, he says, the Gyan Bapi mosque issue should be determined through courts or conciliation. Are you willing for that or not? Or are you sticking to your line that Places of Worship Act prevents any change in status quo, period. Exactly, I agree with you. That is, that is what my stand is, that is what my stance would be. That 1991 Act is now part of basis to the Constitution. That is it, simple as that. You know, so, Rajdeep, you, you, yeah. no, no, please, please allow me half, half, a, half a minute. You yes. say that let us sit and talk. A poor Jain community old man was beaten on the suspicion of being a Muslim. What should I talk? You, you, you demolished 22 houses in Khargon, 13 houses in Sendwa without giving notice. All of them are Muslims. You demolish his warehouse in Khambat in Gujarat. You know, you want to erase every cultural issue that contradicts with your ideology. 